My name is Jan Voiter, and in this section we're going to look at stations, adding a polycom phone manually as a station. As polycom phones fall under our managed IP phones range, they are actually added under the server container managed IP phones. To manually go and add a new polycom phone, simply right click in the list view, select new, give the device a name, it's going to call it my new phone. You can optionally select a template if you have got a template for that type of device already configured. Select the type, either a workstation if it is going to be controlled by the Interaction Desktop, alternatively a standalone phone if it is not going to be controlled by the Interaction Desktop. The manufacturer in our case is Polycom and I can select the model, in my case I am going to add a VVX500. The model of the phone can normally be found on the back of the phone device itself or at the bottom printed on the label. Once you've decided the details as far as the phone is concerned, you can specify the display name of that device. You can optionally specify the MAC address of the device if it is known. Alternatively, you can use provisioning uh, of the phone device to supply that to the IC server. Specify the registration group the location of the phone, in my case I've only got this one default location, firmware versions and the audio protocol either RTP or secure RTP if you are using encrypted audio. Once you've done the basic selections on the phone you can then go and add the key layout. In my case I'm simply going to add a single extension to this device by double clicking on key 1. In the configuration page I can add the key label at the extension, I'm going to use 7299 as the extension. Any identification that you want to add in on here. Also, please make sure that you add the licensing for the device. At minimum, the basic station license is required for the audio portion to function. And also make sure that the license is enabled. You do have additional options that you can configure for the devices. These can be configured and please refer to the online help documentation for more details in this environment. Once you've done your configuration, you can simply click on OK. You will then notice that your new device is listed in the list view under the Managed IP Phones, currently in a non-provisioned state. Once you have registered the phone with the IC server, it should show as an up-to-date device on the system. In this section, we had a look at how to add a Polycom phone manually as a station. Thank you very much for joining me and see you again soon.